We have another little item to show you from Ridge Monkey. Ridge Monkey have been very good lately and sent me a couple of things to uh, show off and review for you um, and give you a look and insight of what they actually do. I, um, I, I think these have got high potential. Now, I can't really say they're brilliant because I've not used them a lot, but potentially I think these are going to be fantastic. And I'm going to test out the waterproofnessness of them. Um, but Ridge Monkey, if you don't know Ridge Monkey, they make things like these, these sandwich pans that you can use in and around your van, your camping, your traveling, uh, in your boot, whether you're fishing or just purely just want a, a nice sandwich maker for at home. Uh, they're absolutely fantastic. And I've recently done a review on this one as well. This is the pan. Uh, griddle and pan set again this comes off you can have like a griddle on the top you can flip it over you can cook it on both sides and really fantastic for doing pasta and stuff in it or just cooking sandwiches and things so ridge monkey have a great great a range of stuff but not only that now they're moving into other gear like clothing and accessories now ridge monkey has been renowned and known for fishing gear and uh, tactical gear and because i'm a landscape photographer these are the sort of items that appeal to me and I have a camper van and as you can see I'm in my van at the moment excuse the background noise I've got the heater running um, just trying to keep myself a bit warmer to be honest it's very cold in here so I've got a size small to large I normally have a, a small to medium sorry I normally have a large glove and I thought I'd try something a little bit smaller and I have put these on I've tried them on and there's they're a little bit snug for my chunky quite fat hands but I've got short fingers and that's why I wanted to try a medium so these are a small to medium gloves uh, they are the k2xp tactical glove um, and I've got these because I use other gloves for photography and uh, you might be a fisherman you might be a photographer you might be into walking and these I think are very very good now you can see I've got to squeeze my hand in a little bit but when my hand is in they fit very very well now you're going to ask yourself well you've seen loads of pairs of gloves you know there's all sorts of gloves online and there's all sorts of gloves in the shops and stuff like that why would you want a pair of these ridge monkey tactical gloves well i'm going to tell you why one is because they're waterproof okay these have got a material that is supposed to uh, let the water run off um, they've got this nice zip cord on the side as well and this zip cord you can pull it up tight so you get it nice and snug around your wrist so you don't get any water down the inside underneath your uh, cuffs as well they got the nice Ridge Monkey logos on the side, which is pretty, but why why would I buy these? What what makes these different? Well, on the palms, you can see you've got this lovely, grippy, grippy um, material. This is like a, a, it's almost like a, a rubberized material, which is great for holding your phone without, you know, without dropping it. It doesn't slip out your hand like some gloves when they're just nice and soft and smooth. The other reason is, I'm a photographer, so I use my camera. You might be a fisherman, but I'm a photographer and I want to be able to hold onto my camera and feel it secure in my hand without dropping it and without it sliding out on some thin, soft, um, comfortable sort of woolen gloves. So these have got these nice grip on the palms, as you can see on the bottom there. They've got a lovely grip on the bottom and it's all the way across as well. But what more? What more? Why are these any better than any others? Well, I can get... Pull my finger out. I can get my fingers out not only my fingers but look how much finger i can get out of these gloves they've got a long a great big long uh, section on the top which you can pull back and it's got a magnet on so you can stick it back to the back of your glove and it will stay there and i pull it back properly like that it stays on the back of the glove you can see there and also i can get my thumb out and they fold back and they stick on the bottom just like that they're brilliant so when i've got my fingers out not only have i got all that nice added grip for holding onto the camera and it's it's really nice and comfortable i can also use all my controls on my buttons on the top of my camera and i don't have to worry about my fingers and not being able to feel the buttons on the back of the camera absolutely brilliant i love the idea of these sort of gloves and the fingers come out and they're really really long these pieces that come out are quite long you have to stretch your finger over and get them back in but when you get your finger back in because they're so long they fold right back over the bottom of the glove and then you can get them in i normally use me feet me, me teeth to pull them off and things like that but you can get them in and when your hands are in your fingers become all nice and warm because they've got this nice overlap so again like i say i've got short fingers and the tops just fold over just a little bit um, because i have got 
the short stumpy fingers but the fit I think is really good now I'm going to test these in water I'm going to get these nice and wet I'll do a little bit of b-roll maybe put it over the top of this screen and run some water on them spray some water on them Ridge Monkey have just sent me a uh, 12 volt power shower as well so I might get the power shower out and just spray water all over them and simulate the rain on them and see how how dry they keep my hands uh, Just reporting that the gloves themselves seem to be staying quite warm and dry on the inside but you do get a bit of water through the fingers obviously where the fingers are open so uh, yeah that's a bit of an extreme test but it's done still dry on the inside but the fingers do let a bit of water in where they're open. But it will keep your hands warm and the back of my hands are definitely, definitely dry. Uh, I've got my phone on and you can see me there. Um, if I scroll across the top, you can see that um, I'm on accessories at the moment, but there are other things. You've got power supplies, um, you've got um, baiting stuff, you've got cooking stuff, you've got buckets and clothing and luggage they do so much now on this website it really is an amazing amount of stuff they've come so far they really have so at the moment i'm on accessories um as you can see on the top there and if you scroll down accessories you've got hot water bottles you've got tactical gloves which i'm going to look at now uh, you've got the waterproof gloves and you've got cool box you've got all sorts of stuff you've got lights and oh, there's, there is there's there's so, so much i just can't really go for go through it all this this is just the accessory action you've got an escape bunk sleep system whatever that is the work it's just it's I know it's designed for fishing but there's so much more for so many other people right so let me have a look on the tactical gloves these are the AP Errol Errol AP Errol I'm, I'm I'm dyslexic I don't do reading very well and these are the K2 XP tactical gloves now these are not actually the ones listed as waterproof gloves but if you look down recommended retail price is 24.99 so 25 pound for a decent pair of gloves that you can wear in the cold and the rain and use your camera gear and your you know accessible for fingers like if you want to scroll your phone and play with your phone if you're out walking and hiking i think is a reasonable price i really do um folding magnetic magnetic uh, external fingers i showed you that so the fingers fold back and stick on very very well and very very easily insulated brushed polyester lining it says they are waterproof windproof and breathable adjustable elastic wrist cuffs which i said so they are saying they're waterproof so i will give these a test and i will run these underwater and i'll put a note up for you at the end uh, to let you know how i've got on with them so i'm going to test them out and see what they're like so i'm going to flick through a few pictures for you just to see if there's any pictures on it they do them in a green as well i think they do them in a green and a black which is quite nice you get the choice of choice of colors um you can see on the screen there i've got down the bottom here it says green and black and they do them in a small medium or a large extra large so i think i've picked the right size to be honest shell is a 94 percent polyester and six percent spandex uh, the palm is 50 percent polyester and 50 percent uh, pu that's the palm which is like i say a very grippy like a rubberized sort of feel to it uh, and it's got a membrane of a TPU membrane. I think that might be the waterproofness -ness 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 stuff. Um, so yeah, really, really good. But yeah, I, I'm, I'm blown away by the amount of stuff on the Ridge Monkey website. So I do urge you to come on and have a look. There is such a lot on this website. Um, I'm sure there is something that will interest you. Uh, you've just got to find it, that's all. 
Um, clothing again, I'm going to have a look at clothing because look, they do socks and t-shirts and jackets and fleeces and soft shells and hard shells and there's just so much on there. They've got um, full, fully waterproof gloves by the looks of it there as well, uh, beanie hats, even slippers and sandals and look at that, aqua shoes. That'd be great to have a pair of aqua shoes when you're out walking near, you know, in the lakes and um, stuff like that so you can actually park up your van, park up your car and go and get a dip. Um, so yeah, I will be having a look at some more stuff as we go along throughout the year. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm going to put some put these through the test. I want to see how waterproof they are and um, I'll report back at the end of this and let you know. So thanks for watching. Ciao for now. See you soon. And uh, yeah, check out some of the other Ridge Monkey gear. These things are amazing. If you haven't got a sandwich pan, get one. Highly recommended. And I don't know anyone that hasn't got one that goes out walking, hiking, camping, etc, etc, etc. Bye-bye. I've got to go.